Hi everybody, so if you have the textbook already, that's great. This is what it what it is. That's the front cover. It's this is the name, the author, the ISBN number. Um, if you're in Math 70, you'll probably need it for Math 97 next quarter and possibly Math 98. So there's the same book for Math uh, 70, 97, and 98. Um, so like if you're in Math 97 and you're not going to take Math 98, then um, you only need it just for Math 97. And so you might think about renting it. If you're just take just taking Math 98, you might just rent it because you only need it for one quarter for that class as well. But like if you're taking Math 97 and Math 98, then it'd be good to buy it to have it for both quarters, right? So um, the entire book is available online for free if you're okay using eBooks. Um, and I'll show you how to use that. So you click here. Um, and what what you, if you could find this little 2F symbol there, click on that and look how nice that is. This is the first section that pops up and if you scroll down that's the te textbook and then you get to these problems and these are the textbook homework questions we'll be doing. One, two, three, four, five and whatever is listed I list on Canvas, right? And if you look at the um, address bar here, if I want to have a look at say chapter 7 section 3, I just do this, right? And now we'll see 7.3 pop up, right? There it is, 7.3. And I can scroll down and see the textbook homework questions right there. See that? Um, so what else? Um, you, if, if you want the paper copy, uh, try to get a used book uh, and you can get them pretty cheap online. You can also buy it or rent it at the Grace Harbor College bookstore. I've also uploaded uh, files of the first week or the homework for the first week or two. So the point is, if you don't have a textbook right now, that doesn't matter. You can get started working right away.